I have a question. Why are so many men so scared of approaching women nowadays? They want to know why we are no longer motivated to approach them. We have the answer in this video. There's like this huge problem that I've been noticing in the dating world. The good, good, respectful men, the men with boundaries, will not approach women because they're trying to respect their boundaries. And you serious? it is true that biologically speaking, women are far more attuned to subtleties, like body language subtlety. Boring. So a lot of times, women will actually be giving off clues and cues that they want to be approached. Here you go again. They're like they're trying to give off a vibe or something and the man has no idea. What ends up happening is that it's the men with no boundaries or that don't respect boundaries or the narcissists or the creeps that end up approaching the woman. What do you mean by that? And then the women in my life complain that it's only the creeps that approach them when it's really, we women need to be giving off way more intense. That is not completely true. Many good guys approach, but the response they get is where the issue comes from. And this is why most of them are no longer approaching. What would make her think that only men with no boundaries are the ones approaching women? I couldn't even understand her logic. Based on what she just said, doing the approach is a bad thing. It means that you don't respect the other person. How can this make sense? But she forgot to mention that approaching becomes okay when the guy is Chad or Tyrone. But I give her credit for saying that they need to give more intense clues. That was a valid point and would make the all process a lot better. I have a question. Why are so many men so scared of approaching women nowadays? Really, nigga? We aren't scared. We just don't want to be labeled as creeps. We are minding our business and enjoying our peace. The way I think about it is either I'm ugly, which is, <laughs> which is why guys don't talk to me, or I'm like too attractive that they're intimidated, which is why they don't talk to me. And I don't think I'm ugly, so I'm going to go with option number two. This is where these ladies get it all wrong. They think too highly of themselves. What is so special about her that we will be intimidated to approach her? She said she doesn't feel she is ugly. It's up to us to tell you if you are ugly or not. Beauty is in the eyes of the beholder. Even if she feels she is attractive, her attitude doesn't look attractive. Ladies crave this attention that we aren't ready to give them. I will share a clip to show you a practical example of what I'm talking about. The way these ladies react to men in public places is so rude and discourages men from approaching them. Do you need something? Do you need something? Oh, God, please, no! No! Okay, I thought so. Are you okay? Keep the question. If you're getting, if you're getting moved, you can leave. Nobody was living in this type of way. Yeah. I don't own the gym, I, I work here. Okay. Yes. And that if you're getting rude, then you can leave. That means what? I can go out of police and have you trespassed mm -hmm. right now. Would you like that? Go ahead. Okay, cool. Go ahead, let, let them know. know. These ladies crave attention at all costs. How will a lady this rude expect a man to approach her? If he wasn't a staff there, the next thing we would have seen was a video on social media with the tag, Creep at the Gym. So what will make another man want to approach such a lady? I noticed that a lot of females wonder why dudes don't try to holler at them anymore. It's not because you're ugly or anything like that, it's just that shit has become so difficult. Back in the day, the worst thing we had to worry about was getting rejected. Nowadays, we gotta worry about getting screenshot, called thirsty, and the worst of them all, getting a video of us, getting rejected, put on the internet. The funny thing about the females who like to screenshot and call you thirsty is when a screenshot is coming from a text message conversation that y'all had. How thirsty can I possibly be if I already have your number? Y'all never fail to mention that he's thirsty, but y'all always fail to mention how he got your number. It has gotten to points where even having online chat isn't safe with these ladies, as they can go miles to get attention. Men are beginning to feel satisfied and fulfilled by themselves. We aren't moved or obsessed by women, irrespective of what they put on. I got a lady who said something in the next clip. There's a stat on Facebook, and basically it says, men are not obsessed with women like they used to be. Y'all don't find that kind of weird? Yeah, baby. <laughs> yeah. Be honest, no, I don't find that kind of weird because what exactly is there for men to be obsessed with in today's world? Women have left no room for imagination, none whatsoever. It's like y'all sense of entitlement is out of control. Y'all 
expectations are unrealistic. Y'all walk around showing y'all bodies half dressed, half exposed 24 7, out smoking, drinking, partying 24 7, on the scene 24 7. A lot of y'all are not even coming with nothing to the table because you're too busy with your hand out trying to see what man got the next bag so he can sponsor your lifestyle to make you look like you're living a lifestyle to post on the internet. It's like a lot of y'all don't have common sense. A lot of y'all don't know how to hold a conversation. A lot of y'all don't have no originality about yourselves. Everybody is getting the same body. Everybody is getting the same hairstyle. Everybody looks the exact same. And it's like y'all get that confused. Good one. But men are not wiping that and they're not cuffing that. And I think y'all are starting to realize that. And then the first thing y'all want to say is, oh, well, they're gay. They're sassy. No, they're not. They're just tired of what you guys are presenting. And if y'all are here to give them free put everything they ain't got to work for, uh, why would they? But they're never going to take you serious. So it seems to me like a lot of y'all are now starting to realize that you're either losing value or have lost value from chasing attention. Wait a minute. Who are you? That y'all got to deal with and y'all can't face that fact. Men love women that are exclusive. Women that are put up. They pile up unrealistic expectations, wanting us to be what we aren't even when they have nothing to bring to the table. Men can't meet their standards. We have better things to pursue in life. We have more pressing issues, dreams, and aspirations to attend to other than spending the time to chase a lady that can't be satisfied. Ladies, why are men not chasing women anymore? And it really comes down to this. Culture, social, wisdom, knowledge, experience, all right? It, it, we're in a time now where information is so widely accessible that men have been able to share experiences, knowledge, wisdom, hear other women's testimonies that it's just, it's unnecessary to chase a woman. It just doesn't make any sense, right? Especially giving to the fact of how most girls act today, how they think today, how much they actually value men today. Um, it's just it's just not a good thing to chase a woman in 2023 and moving forward. Now, granted, if women started changing and really value a man and saying how much they love them and appreciate them and, and respected them, then yeah, we, we wouldn't mind chasing a girl, for sure. We have gotten all the experiences we need. We have learned from past mistakes, heard the testimony of other men, and we have become wiser now. Men should stop wasting compliments on ladies. It does them no good, but only makes them feel like they are so special that men can't do without them. Why aren't you guys approaching women anymore? Like I was at a bar and everyone is in their own groups, not approaching strangers. Like not one guy, not even just for me, not one guy went up to a girl and just started talking to her. It was so weird. And I'm like... The routine has changed already. Now men go to bar to meet with friends and have the best moments. It's not to meet with a girl who might end up asking you to buy her a drink. Nothing really happened. We aren't ready to be messed around with. I got some clips of different men giving their opinions on this reasons why they don't chase women anymore. The same ones that be like, we so thirsty whenever we actually do chase y'all. And now y'all are complaining that we're respecting ourselves to the point we're not chasing you. Stop it. I could have sworn it was women Complaining about being catcalled, complaining about dudes hitting on them all the time, complaining about the unwanted attention. So now we fall back and let y'all present to us that you want the same thing we want. Now it's an issue. This new generation of women suck. Bro, it's not even that. It's just like us men, we know our work. Like, if you want us, you know how to come find us. Like, we not finna do all that chasing and get turned down and look embarrassed and shit. Like, that shit old. It's a new generation. It's 2022, about to be 2023. But I'm gonna have to take a hard pass. Chasing women is not the way to go. The way for men to go is exactly the way that our mothers tried to teach us a long time ago. Be who you are and what is for you will be drawn to you. A girl is, in a sense, running from me or playing games, so to speak, trying to keep my interest and dragging along or whatever, and I gotta keep chasing, I ain't gonna bother. Because if she's running from me, obviously she ain't for me. She's just playing mind games. And I personally, I'm just not really down with that. But there are plenty of people who are. Oh! Ew! It's not about being pursued. It's more the fact of Showing me the same effort back in return. 
the guy that you wanted to be entertained by finally give you the attention and now you just left us to the wayside. When it comes to relationships and or marriages, it can't always be a one way street. Both parties have to be involved. Both parties have to give them the same type of energy, connection, time, resources, and all that stuff to make that relationship work. It always can't be, I give more than the other person does. Don't be afraid to ask men for things. Like men are literally not afraid to ask us for anything. They will ask you to take your clothes off in two seconds. So it doesn't matter. Ask them, give me money. It's time men need to stop chasing these modern women that wouldn't appreciate it. It's time we focus more on ourselves, showing ourselves the love that we deserve. What are your opinions on this video? Let me know in the comments. That will be all for today. Thank you for watching. Please give us a like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you get notified whenever we post a new video.